And it's only our relationship with Christ that's going to get us through. The only, it's the only thing. And that's why, you know, folks, that's why we're learning how to spend time with Father. Really build a personal relationship with Him. Not have Him be this detached metaphysical reality that is somehow supernaturally, you know, doing things for us, some kind of genie in a bottle. A real relationship, real Father. Right? I want to give it a one time for Brother Lowell right there. See that young, see that man over there? Let's give it a one for him. Raise your hand, Brother Lowell, people who don't know you. He shared an amazing testimony last week. You guys all saw it who were here. I don't know if it went out on the internet. I don't know. But I talked to him. He said, you know, feel free to share, share about it. But uh, he was, of course, he shared it last, not last week. He was suffering for about two months with the spirit of suicide. The devil was telling him, you got that gun right on your hip every day. Pull it out, boom, do it. Come on, all your pain will be gone. Of course that's a lie. Your pain will be now forever. Right? It's a total lie, but the devil doesn't care. So this demon was on him, pushing him. Come on, come on, do it, Dad. Yeah, you're, like, you're just a workhorse. You, know, you, don't, you, like, you lost your retirement. All this, all this, right? And Brother Lowell said, wow, he was, he was battling this demon, right? And then last week when we were, in the, when we were worshiping, remember, remember, at, remember that, that time last week where we said, okay, who wants to break? And some, and they, some of the brothers and sisters came in and laid down on the, on the altar here. Remember that? That morning, Father said, somebody needs to lay down. That's why I asked somebody to lay down. And then so I asked, and I saw Brother Hello's hand. I said, Brother Lowe, that's you. Come on, lay down, man. If you didn't see that, go check out, that, check out the worship last week. And Brother Lowe laid down. He was laying down here, and he told me, wow, he told me something. He said, when he was laying down on that altar... The devil said to him, hey, why don't you show the whole world how sad you are? Why don't you do it? You got your gun on you right now. Why don't you do it in front of the whole world wide audience? That's what the devil was saying, trying to, you know, intimidate him. And then he just said, you know, and then remember that time when we were praising God and the young people were up here and they were singing? And I just said to them, hey, you guys sing it like you mean it. You don't know whose life is going to change. Remember that? Yes. Like sing it like you mean it or your, your life depend on it or, your, or somebody else's life depend on it. Sing it like you mean it. Yes. I remember the young people, I mean, they, you know, I mean, they just did as, you know, they just had faith and just did it. Father, we pray for those, our brother and sister who are before laying down at your feet. We praise you. Father, our brother and sister who have something heavy on their heart right now, Father, we ask that you would touch them now. You would touch our brother and sister who are laying at your feet. That you would answer the heaviness on their heart. And I will be victorious. Yes, Lord. Because I stand with my Father has won the race and who has defeated the enemy and who stands above the grave and mighty and all high looks upon us. And Brother Lowell, he said when he was in that worship, he was laying on the ground, he said he felt this black like, like spirit leave his body and slink off the, the altar. Is that right, Brother Yeah. Oh, it was retching. That's right. That's right. It was like, it was trying to throw up, right? So he was like, he was heaving, right? And then it, it pulled out. And then he felt this freedom. Come on, let's give God some praise for that. That's amazing. This is a true man. I mean, he is as gentle as... You know, a gentle giant. But when evil comes, he will stand, risk his life for it, against it. You know, this is, this is a real man, you know? A real man. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound.
that seed a wretch like me.